Oh wow, this is this could be interesting, couldn't it? Fifty fifty. If he's a if he's a good dwarf player it could be tricky. But um if it's not if he's not a good coach then Oh it's the same guy, isn't it? It's the same it's the same coach as the as the oh, I've just played. The necros. So dwarves are funny, obviously the dice is always a factor. But if they're a good coach, I think dwarves about fifty fifty with uh, lizards because they've got they've got advantages and disadvantages, haven't they? Whereas if if one play one coach is good, I think it becomes a good matchup. <laughs> I could play against you, yeah, Fashbinder. At least the sage can play. Wow! How dare you, Pedro Jack? How dare you? Yeah, the same guy. It should be an easy concede, shouldn't it? But I mean, yeah, now he's he's less likely to get players uh, removed, isn't he? But then I guess less likely to remove them himself. Though he'll get the block will be good against the Soros. He can half dice them. No problem. Yeah, I'll have a, I'll have a friendly against Tucky then if if he wants one. The 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 big thing is going to be when we get the uh, legendary edition, isn't it? And we can have we can have custom teams. That's going to be really good. <laughs> All right, we love. We'll have a we'll have a ducky game then. If he's up for it after this. Oh, two weeks. Two weeks was amazing. I'm doing space to, to zoom out like um like uh Like what's it called? See, now I saved defensive setup one, and I saved it over, and it didn't save over it. So it's got nothing at all to do with changing the changing the um, formations. It just doesn't work when you save over formations. It's an absolute fact. Right. Um, this is all right. <laughs> um um hello pablo yeah it was it was pretty great but there was there was um there was the month with yeah very little blood ball in a month um But not oh, P Diddy. Right, let's fucking go then. The bad thing is that you can maybe get the skinks, but fuck it. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. Uh, what what TV are they, Ducky? We could we could just use one of our old one of our old teams, our old our old champion ladder teams. So yeah, could do um, could do that. Twenty one hundred. Fuck me, I ain't got anything close to that. But uh, whatever, whatever my highest TV team is, then. Is <laughs> mm. Frenzy traps weren't that successful, but never mind.
I mean, he's got block, right? So that the omens isn't isn't as good against him as it would be against anybody else. You are not no Sledger, It is exactly the same. It's just that it's that, that's all it is. The full legendary game has that as well. Yeah, maybe the Nurgle team, or maybe the Chaos. Team. See, that's the thing. You can minus two Demi. It's not even bad, is it? The, there you go, Kale. Instant apple. Oops. Oops. Quite like to get the crocs into the ball here. Base the ball! <laughs> Base the ball! Because Little Nog, they're unlikely to do anything else to me, even though they're dwarves. Um, I could block him and then just blitz through. One, two, three, four, five, six, double G if I'd hit the ball. It'd be pretty fucking good, wouldn't it? Do all the safe moves first, then go for that. Then he could even recover. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. So this one first with a re-roll possible. Okay, good enough. I don't really like the re-roll and um, the re-roll, the apple for lizards, because I think you know they they essentially don't need an apple. So I like to just apple the first thing that happens to them. I did base a fucking thing, didn't I? It was a bit stupid, didn't it? But I couldn't really move him first anyway. Right, just just go for this, eh? Double GFI. Why not? Get to fuck. Another concession incoming. Yeah, I was pretty lucky. I mean, it was about 50-50 to make it, wasn't he, with three, three two-plus rolls to get there. Um, but, you know, if he gets there, good things happen, don't they? I mean, I could have just won GFI'd and blocked the guy next to him, but... I don't know. I didn't mind that. I didn't mind if it failed, really. That was the thing. Might double GF here, might me. <laughs> well, freak! It was a, it was a double GFI. Um, why not? Is what I thought. I mean, maybe that would have been a better move if I had, uh, if I hadn't uphold the KO. Um, because then I'd be in more desperation stakes, wouldn't I? Ooh, get out, you cunt. Movement 8. Movement 8, Krog. Alright, good double one. Sweet. So do I just go for the touchdown? Could do. Safe moves first. He could blitz him. Get him out of the way. Get in there, 
so he's basing two. Seems all right. I guess get him there so he's over the ball. But yeah, I've got to do this 2D, haven't I? Got to try and clear him. Oh, shit. That is a shame. Let's so maybe go for this dodge then now, just so that he's got the um, got something on the ball. Go for the 50-50, don't re-roll it. Got it. Go for the touchdown. I think go for the touchdown and just try to score on. Just try to be the one more. It makes the it makes the apple on the KO worse. Um, but you know the payoff with him with him. Like if he hadn't boneheaded, if he'd cast like let's say he'd knocked over this guy and powered him, not cast him. If he knocked him over and powered him, then maybe I could just chill here pretty safely. But. Um, I've got a dodge at least. Can't can't touch down foul. Have to dodge at least. What the fuck did he go over there? Um but he could waddle one, two, three, four, double GFI, at least base. One, two, three, four, double GFI. So maybe here would be pretty safe. But um yeah, score and beat on them some more seems seems like a good idea, doesn't it? But I don't know, stalling against dwarves is so good. I don't really want to score this quickly against them. He could pow him, he could pow him, one, two, three. He could pow him and then he could run through one, two, three, four, double GFIs. So There's probably nowhere safe. That was a pretty bad, pretty bad bonehead. After after him being amazing, the the previous three two pluses that he passed. Um, maybe here would be safe. To be honest, block him. One two three, four double GFI, four double GFI. One two three four double GFI. I don't have any Saurus there. And he's gonna blitz one of them. He's gonna blitz a skink, isn't he? That's the thing. <laughs> That's the key thing, he's gonna blitz a skink. So um this way he's not gonna blitz a skink. Hello Inarian. Oh thank you. Sorry blockers, oh dear. That's the thing, he's going to blitz a skink. Not just blitz a skink, but yes, blitz with block and tackle. Yeah. It's bad enough when they get the blitzy with block, you know, like... Um, no, Inari, you're definitely not done with the car game. No, I'll be playing it later, but I thought I'd start on Blood Bowl. And then... You know, every day I'm going to start on the Blood Bowl and then go to the uh, go to crossout afterwards. Hello, Squirrel Dude. Uh, VIP scroll, dude. Yeah, that's the thing. The thing with the car game is, I don't think it's a great game to um, like grind with all the time. Um, so I just play a bit. Fantastic. Well, that's the thing. They're moving forward, though, isn't it? So while they have the tools to bring them down, that's the, that's the thing. These kind of games are often. Like, obviously, decided by luck. All games have got a, a big element of luck in, haven't they? But a lot of times, like, it's a lot worse against a good dwarf player than it is against a bad dwarf player. Uh, it, but it's this, you know, it's like, it's kind of an, uh, a more pronounced version of Lizardmen versus Dwarf um, Orcs, where you've got the Orc Blitzers that are movement six. And agility three with block that you really don't want to hit your skinks. But then with these, 
the mo <laughs> they've got block and tackle, but they're only movement four with the agility too, so they're not really that crazy, crazy of a threat, are they? for the, the dwarf wall. Should've moved in first, shouldn't I? Do you know what squirrel did? I didn't, but I do have my aviators, but I don't have my uh, jacket. Um, no, not soccer cars, no uh, cross out. And Fashtastic League will be happening in Legendary Edition, yeah, but can't. I couldn't even test it. I didn't, I didn't, um, the first Legendary Edition beta weekend, I didn't have it. And I was in England and stuff, so I just didn't do anything. But, you know, the next weekend they do it, I'll, uh, I'll do it. <laughs> Alright, thanks. <laughs> we had the, me and my friend had the great idea of having Iceman turn up and just, just sit there. Sit there and do nothing. It was because <laughs> he's six foot seven. <laughs> just sit there and look intimidating, just staring. I thought it was a great idea. Fashtastic League will happen, yeah. Yeah, well, I did not try it out whatsoever, no. No, I did not try it out at all. I thought I'll wait till I'm till I'm streaming it. Fucking one dice is high here, and it was dwarves. Can't blame him. Hmm. Can I push him to there, him to there, push him to there, push him to there, knock him down, push him out, and then blitz the ball? I think that's possible to blitz the ball this turn um, with some good rolls. So let's find out. Good enough. This would have to be a power thing. Does this work? I don't even know. No, no, I'd have to dodge. I'd have to block him first. And it'd have to be a half die, so it doesn't work. Oh, well. It could have worked. One, two, three, four, five for the cro crocs and get in with him, which is alright, isn't it? He can get on him. And he'll just have to blitz this dude. I have to re roll this one, I think. If it had been a 1 in 9. I mean, I'm just giving away a 2D there, aren't I? Maybe giving away a surf, but he's got to do some. He's got to do some things to make it work. Giving away a blitz there, haven't I? That was dumb. He should be in the middle. Yeah, man, play for a removal, why not? Why not? You can you can happen. It can happen. Alright, see you Narian. Yeah, fling matches, yeah. 
Yeah, I just thought I'd save it for save it for stream. You know, a good part of being on holiday was not having to play football, so <laughs> I was happy taking advantage of the of the not having to play football part of the holiday. Loves his GFIs, doesn't he? <laughs> no, no, Dr. Mom Bosco. Nothing as epic as eating best fag or frenzy trap here. Nothing as epic as eating best fag or no. Um, oh, gets away with it. The dingo. Well, this is uh, 2D on the ball here, isn't it? Unless... The Crocs failing to stand up would be bad. Oh, you can just push him. Oh, well, fair enough. Still two dice on the ball, though, isn't it? Still two dice on the ball. Um, it just would have been easier. Uh, you know, Crocs, Crocs failing. <laughs> it was always going to happen. Oh, no, there's no, it's not too deep on the ball, is it? That was a really bad, really bad, um, Failure by the Croxy. Banged on him. Yeah, winning is fun. That's true. I don't have any bait data to back that assertion, but in my experience, I've not. I've not heard any sounds. No, I am. Um, well, I saw a bit of the, you know, Kanor and Sage game. Um, I should block this guy, shouldn't I, because he's got tackle. GFI. GFI without a reroll? Yeah, do that first. Because at least he's, he's nearer the ball then, isn't he? And this one failing isn't so bad. Even if he one days him and blitzes him, he still can't really get through. Can he? Bit of an overcommit here, though. Bit of an overcommit to the left side there. Um. Hell, conflicts and milk. Is is it similar to a witch? The witch elf sound. Yeah, concede incoming, maybe. <laughs> Lodge guard firm long beard and a blood roller, yeah, pretty good. Yeah, it was a bit of an overcommit, but the thing is, skinks are movement eight, aren't they? So it doesn't really matter. He's running out of time. Oh, and re -roll, out of re rolls. Tabletop, everyone hates me. Yeah, that's the thing about tabletop, isn't it? You don't want everybody to hate you on on tabletop. Oh, 
Okay, so could surf one of those dwarfs. But is it worth using the blitz there? Probably not. A blitz with the crocs to get on the ball. Probably worth it. Do a safe move first. Canoring threat. Straight up. Straight up canoring threat. And a safe move first. Got the knockdown for the cheeky crocs blitz. Could just block him and then move him. One, two, three, four, five, six. If I knock him down, so yeah, go for this one. And go for this one. Just think that thing there is fine. I think. God, glorious. Yeah, it could could have surfed, could have surfed, but um, I just thought it was more important to um, you know, fuck with the runner, as it were. So he's just going to dodge away from him. He can't really do anything else. He can block him. He can blitz him. And then... He can block him. Block him. Could double mark him. But he's already got a dodger anyway, hasn't he? I think. So I'll put him here. Tackle roll. Dodge to here, then his only dodge out is there. If one D him, then free him up. Yeah, playing dwarves is bad enough, whatever skills you take. I think this would be kind of nice, but then I regret moving him as, as a scoring threat position if I do that. Maybe just put him there. So he can't he can't go around this side then. Or here. So he really can't go this way. And I've got another canoring threat then, haven't I? So he's gonna have to come out this way. <laughs> So I guess I should just put him here. Because he was already probably just going to dodge away this way. So I guess I panicked a bit. I should have just moved him here. You can block him, block him. Blitz him. Run out of here. He's not going to score though, so... Alright, good. Now there can be some surfing action. Holy shit.
Sam had cop wins. I don't know, screw it. I'm probably not going to try to qualify with the, either of those teams. To be honest. Go for the pickup on the Saurus, I guess. Because I've got the pickup with a skink the next turn anyway. Double two. Skink would have failed. Guess I should have gone. <laughs> should have gone for the skink, <laughs> but would have failed anyway. And there's still a chance. It was really greedy. It was really greedy. But the thing is, I'm already winning 1 0, aren't I? So. I'm already winning 1 0, that's the thing. If I wasn't winning 1 0, um, no, I wouldn't have gone for it. Can I make these three then? One, two, three, four, five, six. I guess I can. Well, I mean, I could, but fuck it. Oh, I can't surf him, can I? Yeah, I can. I thought I'd block my my route to surf him. But obviously, totally hadn't. You can tell I'm rusty. Go for a three dice there. Might as well. And unfortunately, no, no uh, touchdown foul attempt. <laughs> At least he let me score and surf his guys. <laughs> That's very nice of him, wasn't it? Okay. So, um, well, that was good, wasn't it? Sixty K. I can, um, oh, let's level up this guy. Sidestep. I do like the sidestep. Buy him. Suck him. So under the under the money. Um there you go, it was good, wasn't it? Another MVP for a Saurus, or so three MVPs on Saurus is alright. And a couple of cars on some dudes. Um Fair enough. Right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.